what's up? Black Eyes is coming at you with another one. This evening, I decided to roll out to the dam. It was a pretty cool evening. Uh, it was maybe the mid 50s, I guess. And uh, hadn't ridden a bike in a few days because I had been working so much. Uh, I know it's been a while since I put a Riker video out, and that's why. Uh, I have been working a lot. Don't forget to hit that like button. Smash that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. So you'll know when future videos are coming. And I promise they'll be more frequent. Um, but it, it's been crazy here these last few weeks with work. and um, I've got a lot of stuff going on planned for next year. So... Uh, just been busy man but I am putting this Riker video out and I'm riding back to the uh, Oliver Lock and Dam um, there were some motorcycle groups that were gonna be at one of the dams but they didn't specify which one so I didn't know if they were gonna be at Hope uh, Lock and Dam or Oliver Lock and Dam so I decided to roll the dice and uh, see if they were going to be out here at Oliver Lock and Dam. Uh, the sun was setting. Like I said, it was a cool, brisk evening. And uh, just decided to see what was up. Just aching to ride. Hadn't ridden in a minute. So, really, I was just aching to get my roll on. Uh, shout out to Julie, the president of Rocket Riders Alabama, and shout out to ISCI uh, for hooking me up with that cool shirt. Uh, check them out. Check out their website, ISCIRide.com. Um, they just put out a handbrake for the Riker. Really cool. Um, I think King Joffrey Joe is the first one to actually do an install on this handbrake. He just dropped the video, so um, go check out King Joffrey Joe's video on uh, the handbrake installation. It's real cool, so check it out. I'm thinking about getting one of those joints myself, but uh, we'll see. As you can see, the sun is shining pretty brightly as it was setting right there at the dam. It was all in my eyes, but um, I could see pretty well. And I was just really just taking my time, soaking it all in. It was a beautiful view of the sun setting and uh, a man walking his dog there. and I see a few cars out. But, uh, didn't see no motorcyclists. So I'm like, yo, what, did I miss them? Or maybe I just went to the wrong one. But while I was here, I decided to just get out and, um, just walk out to the dam and enjoy the view for a minute. Which was cool. I mean... I'll catch up with the cat with the fellas the next go round, but uh, there I am hopping off Carnage, and let me get off of here and see and check out the view and just soak it all in, take a deep breath, and sometimes you just gotta enjoy these little moments, and uh, that's what I did while I was out here. I wasn't out here very long; just it started getting a little chilly, so I decided to just. Go out and soak it all in real quick. So, um, check it out. I'm getting all my stuff together, putting my gloves up and all. And, uh, had to put the fingerless gloves up because it's, like I said, it's starting to get a little nippy. So, 
uh let's go out here and see what's going on with the view i think it was a couple of motorcycle clubs that were supposed to come out here sometime today i must have missed them because uh there's nobody out here You can see it's pretty lovely out here. Well, as lovely as it can be for a dam, I guess, but uh, it's cool, you know. Some people bring their boats out here and some people fish out here or whatever. You can see there's some, I don't know if you can see it that far, but you can see a few little fish out that way a little bit. Of course, they don't want anybody diving out here. I don't know if you can see the sign, but it says danger, shallow water, no diving. You can see a dude out here walking his dog. I don't know where there's a lot of cars out here well not a lot it's a few cars out here but I don't see anyone it's kind of weird so whoever's out here they're obviously on their boats because they got their hitches out here These other cars must have joined them on their boats. Whew. You see carnage. He's chilling. As you can see. I am still loving him. He is closing in on uh, one year. Having him for one year. Of course, he was a Christmas present from my wife last year. It's brand new, 2020. Can Am Rocker Rally. Got a few things to it. Still got a lot I want to do to it, so just stay tuned. Anyway, let's hop back on here and ride a little bit. Hit this alarm. And uh, as soon as I find my keys. Okay. Batteries getting low. I think I leave these gloves on. We're gonna roll out. All right, I'm back on the road, crossing under the bridge that says Title Town on one side. Earlier in the video, you saw me going under through the bridge, going to the dam, and it says. Roll Tide on the other one. Of 
course, Norport slash Tuscaloosa County is the home of the University of Alabama. Whatever, though, because uh, I'm an Auburn fan. War Eagle. <laughs> um, decide to take the scenic route back to the house um, and go through town instead of taking the back roads. So I'm riding up this little ramp here and I will be going downtown. No, Pope. Um, just like in every video, I got to shout out all the rocket riders out there. Of course, shout out to uh, rocket riders. Shout out to rolling on three wheels. What's up, Key? Shout out to my boy Thrill Miles. Thrill Miles hooked me up too. I got a, a nice little one of Thrill Miles' shirts too. Of course, I'm always repping uh, Keith's shirts and stuff. So uh, I'm thankful, man. Uh, shout out to Thrill Miles once again. Shout out to Moochie Gang. I hadn't seen y'all in a minute, man. Shout out to Moochie Gang. Of course, shout out to Lincoln Fam. Uh, just everybody, man. Shout out to all the riders out there. Uh, please don't forget to hit that like, smash that subscribe, and uh, hit that notification bell so you'll know when future videos are coming. Norport has a lot of red lights, and I don't like to sit still at them, <laughs> but who does, you know? I just didn't edit that particular one out of the video. Really don't know why. I just left it in. Um, so here I am rolling through downtown. No hope. Making my way to the cut. Shout out to my sweet Pookity. My beautiful wife Maria. Um, she's got a birthday coming up. Shout out to my mom too. My mom turned uh, 71 on November 9th um, happy birthday to her my wife's birthday is coming up on the 19th so happy birthday to my sweet Pookity I love you very much very much so uh, here I am once again getting caught by another light <laughs> I bet you're like, man, how many lights does no Pope have for such a small town, you know? But anyway, man, that light took forever, too. So that's why it got cut out. It took forever in two days to change. So, um, approaching up here on my left, uh, here in a little bit is a Shell gas station. Every time I ride, by this shell, I kind of get chills, get the willies, because at that spot uh, was where I got hit on my two-wheeler. I had, of course, you know the story. I had a two-wheeler. I had a Suzuki Volusia. I was riding home, uh, going about 45 miles an hour in the middle lane. Somebody crossed the median on me and smacked me. They were in a Ford F-150, messed me up pretty good. Never thought I would ride again. And, um, but, um, saw the three wheels, looked at the spiders first and liked them, but then I saw the Rikers and I figured they were more my speed. Of course, my wife gave the green light for me to get the Riker. And long story short, Black Ice was born. So, there you go. Uh, wouldn't have been possible, though, my wife wasn't down, wasn't uh, on board. Because uh, marriage is not 50-50, in case you didn't know. It's 100-100. Either you all the way in or you all the way out. There is no 50-50, it's 100-100. Message. <laughs> That's your message for the day. But, uh... Anyway, I'm rolling to the house, or to the hoose, I like to say, and um, 
this is a not as long as any of my usual videos so it's it's kind of a shorter one so i'm out i sure appreciate you guys for watching by the time this video gets out though it'll be veterans day so i like to wish a happy veterans day to everyone who has served to protect our freedoms we don't know them all but we owe them all of course shout out to all my family members who have served uh shout out to my aunt uh my uncles uh of course my granddad rest in heaven and uh of course my brother so and everyone like i said everyone who has served i salute you all and thank you for protecting our freedoms we don't know them all but we owe them all for real once again thank you guys for watching this black ice production <laughs> um please hit that like button smash that subscribe uh shout out to all the new subscribers who have come along uh i thank you all uh, don't forget when i hit that 200 i'm gonna throw a little giveaway in there when i hit that thousand i'm gonna do a big giveaway so uh help me get there hit that like hit that subscribe all right i sure appreciate it but i'm rolling up on the house you see moon Knight right there my 2014 camaro so i'm gonna bring this video to a close and soon as i'm parking there's my wife's camaro beauty she's chilling so thank you guys for watching and as always watch out for that black ice on the road As I'm settling in, thank you for watching Arrington all day. Deuces.